What is going on guys, Luna here, and I'm very sick right now, and I just want to uh, let you guys know that's why I haven't been uploading, so I apologize for that, but I have a story today that I think is pretty funny, and I want to tell it, so skipping detention to smoke weed, something, uh, I don't know if any of you have ever done this, but uh, I don't recommend it, you could probably get in more trouble if you skip detention, but my school is pretty uh, easy, and I skip detention all the time, and usually would result in me getting suspended, which is stupid, but... Um, after so long of not do like of skipping detention and not going, they basically eased up on me and I don't get suspended anymore. But this is one of the funnier times of when it happened. So I used to skip school or not skip school, but skip detention to smoke weed all the time. And this was in ninth grade, which is hilarious to me. And when it happened was it was the beginning of ninth grade. So we just came out of the middle school. So we would still go into the middle school a lot and just like explore and walk around when we were stoned. And I'm going to get into the story now. So when I got detention, what I basically what I got caught for is I was skipping math class, and they're like, "All right, you gotta attend attend a detention these three days of the week," and blah blah blah. So I was like, "Okay, sure, sure, yeah, I'm not going to either of them." And I asked my friend, I said, "Yo," because he's always in detention. I said, "Yo, do you have detention this day?" And he's like, "No, I have it Friday." And I said, "Can you reschedule it to Thursday?" Because that's when I had my detention. And he's like, "Yeah, sure, I'll try." So he asked the counselor in the room. And she was like, yeah, sure, just come Thursday and we'll, uh, you know, log the time as a Friday. And she let him. So we had detention the same day. And this is the funniest part. We didn't even have to do this. But we met up right outside the detention room, checked in with the lady. Like, like we, she wrote us down like we were there and then said we have to go to the bathroom. And she's like, all right, be quick. You got five minutes. So we went to his locker. He had like two grams in his locker and like a small little bowl. And we grabbed his stuff and immediately proceeded to the outside. Uh, there's like this back, there's this back door that leads by the weight room. We went out the back door and there's no cameras because there's like a roof that covers you. So we just thought we'd go out there and uh, it's his spot, not mine. I didn't like going out there, but he said it was safe. So I believed him. So we grabbed the stuff. <laughs> we grabbed the stuff, go outside and start smoking. And this is the funniest part. We're smoking. And this is why I think it's story worthy, um, like to tell on the channel. Um, we were smoking and like, we, we got, but like the first bowl was done. We moved on to the second bowl and we were really like, I mean, we we're getting pretty stoned. Like I'm a pretty big lightweight and I think I was on like a, like a week. I wasn't smoking for like a week. So I was pretty stoned. And all of a sudden behind us, there was like a, a loud beeping sound. Like we heard this weird beeping sound and we turned around. And if you guys have these at your schools, you probably do. If it's a big public school, um, to get in the doors, like if you show up late to school and the doors are locked, you have to buzz in and talk to the lady over the intercom. The intercom behind us went off and said, they said both of our names and said, please come to the main office. And our hearts dropped and we were like, Oh no, Oh no, Oh no. And we were just like, okay, what do we do? What do we do? So, we went to open the door, and the door opened, thank God. And we were still, like, mid-smoke session. Keep in mind, the bowl still had a cherry in it. It was smoking. Like, we smelled like weed. And this is why I think it's story-worthy. So, <laughs> we put the bowl away quickly. We, we ran to his locker really fast, put his stuff away. Keep in mind, we're on camera doing this. Um, and then went to the main office, reeking like weed, eyes red. And the main office guy was just like, all right, you got, like, they're like your names? And we gave him our names. Like, yeah, we, they just announced over the intercom for us to come to the office. So they bring us into the office and they're like, hey guys, how you doing today? And we're just like, well, you know, we're fine. And she looks at us, she gives us this really weird look and goes, so what did you tell your teacher a little while ago? And we were like, uh, that we were going to the bathroom. That's what we were doing. She's like, really guys? Cause I have like footage right here. And she clicks open a program. We're like, what's this? And it like, it was a long file name and it's camera footage. Oh, you could see us too giggling, walking out the door, like right where the smoke spot is. And at that point you can't see us anymore. Cause we left the door and uh, he's right. There are no cameras out there. And we're like, Oh, we were just, you know, we kind of lied. We just don't want to go to detention. I straight up, I admitted that I was like, I lied. I just didn't want to go to detention. And he followed with us. And, um, or, and he followed with me and she's like, well, I appreciate your guys' honesty, but just for this, I'm going to have to tell the principal. And we were like, oh my God, like, God damn it. And keep in mind, the lady telling this is the, uh, she's like the vice principal. Like she could do something, but she probably couldn't do that much. But, um, what happened, what ended up happening was we got two extra weeks of detention, which is not a big deal at all. Keep in mind, we were ripped, you know, completely ripped and she didn't even mention it probably didn't even notice she didn't seem like she was noticed we acted pretty damn you know when i get scared i kind of snap out of it so what happened was we got two extra weeks of detention and i think i actually skipped one of the weeks which is hilarious and everything ended up being okay thank fucking god 
So I want to know in the comments below if any of you have ever, you know, left school to smoke weed or anything like that. And if you enjoyed the video, drop a like. So yeah, drop a like if you enjoyed. Let's go for 1k likes. Fucking always hitting it. I love you guys so much. Peace.